Hi and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I just have another Drake Fit box that I want to share with you guys. I cannot believe I already have had 15 Drake, Drake Fit boxes already. That's just insane that I've been on this journey with Drake Fit for 15 whole boxes. That's incredible. So I'm super excited to see what Drake Fit has in this box for me. So if you like the sound of that, keep on watching. All right, let's open it up. I got smart this time. <laughs> Sometimes it's a struggle, but this thing is actually super sharp, so it works really well. Okie dokies. So here is the iconic Drape Fit wrapping paper with the Drape Fit slogan on it. So beautiful, I love that. Okay, it has a note from your stylist, all the information you didn't need to know about them to get in touch with them um and of course the price sheet which i don't like to look at that until we're all done so i don't know what the prices are and i can just go by strictly on what i like to see if i want to buy it and then they always send back a send or return bag so you can always return anything that you don't want to keep so that's always nice that they do that for us so Let's get to the exciting part. All right, it looks like we have a pair of pants in here, which is very exciting because you can never have too many pairs of pants. So this is what it looks like. Super cute colors, it looks like. So let's just jump right into the pants. All right. So they are vintage and stretch, which is nice. They are size eight it looks like which i have lost some weight so i'm a size six but i already had on there that i was a size six because i'm still in the same pants size but i've lost almost five or six pounds so actually these might be a capri which is nice they do have some distressing right here and right here which i can't wear anything distressed at work so that's kind of a bummer that these aren't going to be work friendly but um it's always nice to have a variety of clothing it does have like one two three four five buttons here um i'm not much into that kind of look with buttons but it's okay here is the back of the pants um and they are capri length these are cute if the price is right and they fit great yeah i might keep them but um just by the distressing, it might be a little bit of a no for me just because I can't wear distressing to work. Okay, the next top I have is by, hmm, there's no tag up there. Okay, it, so it's a made in China shirt. It doesn't have a brand which I think they actually sent me this before because I do remember trying something very, very similar to this on and I didn't like it the first time and I don't think I'm gonna like it the second time. It's just not really me. I like the color blue and I do like the um, stitching pattern, but um, just together, not so much. So that's kind of a bummer that they sent me that already and I turned it down once and it's kind of made in china shirt that's kind of weird for it to be in a style box i'm not sure okay so this is size small zanina um which you find this in a lot of companies and this is very long it's a very long stretchy shirt and those typically don't look very flattering on me i don't know why i don't really like things that are super long for a top I don't even wear long cardigans. If I'm gonna wear a cardigan, it's gonna be like a normal length shirt. I don't know, I just don't like long things. Um, and the color for me is too green. I like more of an olive green. This is a very, very bright green. Um, but but the style's cute. I like the V-neck. Um, I do like the color, just not for a shirt. And I do like the long sleeves. And I do appreciate stretch in a top, but not all together. <laughs> so those two tops already for me are a no-go. Okay, so then the next top, this one's very cute. The Workshop Size Medium. Now that is more me. I like 
I don't know why, but my style has very been, like, I like blouses. I don't even know why because I'm wearing a t-shirt right now. But I'm more of a blouse kind of girl. I'm not much into t-shirts, but I don't know. I guess you could say I'm both. But this is super cute. I love the pattern on there. It kind of looks like um, moons, but they aren't. But that's very cute. This is a cute top. I'm very liking this. It is super me. Okay, so this is in the maybe pile. Okay, and it looks like we are on our last thing. Oh, is this a dress or a top? I don't know. It's very cute though. Is it shorts? Okay, so it's, it's a dress. It's not shorts. That's kind of short, <laughs> but very, very cute. That is adorable. That's adorable. The back is like an, a cutout right here. That is super cute. So this is by Hersey, H-E-R-S-Y, size medium. I don't know if this is going to fit. It looks very short, but if it was like, if this was a maxi dress, this would be so my style. I love this. And I like the stretchy in the, in the straps. I don't know. This is super cute. But I think it's going to be too short for me. So I'm thinking this is going to be the winner. So let's go to the try on. Hi, I'm back with um, the recap and everything. Um, so actually I found out I like something about every single piece. I don't know, but I'm not gonna keep them all, of course, because that's just very splurging. <laughs> I'm not doing that. But I just wanna go over everything with you guys. So the purple and white floral dress is $28.99. I thought this was actually longer than I thought. Um, I don't know, it just looked shorter when I was holding it up, but it was actually pretty decently long. Um, and I really love the actual print of this. It's just beautiful, but I think it's just um, turning into fall pretty quickly. So I just don't think I will be, be purchasing this. But overall, I do think this dress was super cute. I love the pattern. I love the material. I actually loved everything about this dress. But um, I'm just not keeping it right now. But this was $28.99. Okay, these capris fit like a glove. I said that I was size 6, but the 8 actually works perfectly. The stretch in these are amazing. Um, I wasn't a big fan of the color of them, but um, I think it works with some pieces. These just were actually really perfect. These are $28.99, so the same as this dress, which is crazy to me that these pants are the same price as the dress, but um, that's okay. I don't think I'm going to be keeping these just because I don't wear a lot of capris and the color choice just wasn't my favorite, but overall, I really did actually love these a lot, so that was that. Okay, so the thing that I am going to be keeping is the cheapest item, which I think it's the best quality and the best, like, looking out of everything, but, um, it's the cheapest. 
Okay, so I think I am gonna be keeping this polka dot white top. I just think this is so beautiful. It's so girly and feminine like me. So I think this is perfect choice for me. This is $26.99, still very pricey, but I'm in love with it. So I think I'm gonna be keeping this. So I'm excited about that. Okay, the next top is this Zanina green top. It is $28.99. I think that's a little high, um, but I did actually really like this one. I loved how the sleeves fit me. They are perfectly to my wrists, usually with long sleeves tops. They're either really baggy or really short, but these were actually perfect. And I love the material. Um, I think it would be good with leggings, but that's really all I would ever wear it with because I just don't like how long it is. I just think that is, a very um I just don't like it so I'm not gonna be keeping this but it is $28.99 and I did enjoy it a lot okay the last top is probably my least favorite and it's the most expensive item which doesn't make sense to me because it's made in China it doesn't even have a brand so why would it be so expensive but it is $30.50 that's that's crazy for a top. That should be how much the pants cost, in my opinion. Um, I just wasn't a big, huge fan of this. I think it looks more manly to me. Um, I don't know, but I do like the color, and I did like how it fit. Just I I don't like I don't like the shirt, and it's expensive, and it's made in China, so. Those are just my opinions. Um, but I did like everything in this box so I'm so thankful that they always send me good quality items um but this is just the winner in my opinion so I'm super glad this was in the box and um thank you guys so much for watching and say hi to Daisy back there <laughs> she's always in the videos now um so thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned for my 16th fit thank you